Hey guys, welcome back to the series of Django. As we are doing the hospital management system using the Django framework, we have done with viewing the appointments for the patient. In this tutorial, we are going to make the login for the doctors as well as the home page profile page for the doctors. So let's get started. Alright, we have already created the views and URLs for login, home page and profile page. But we just need to update them for the doctor as well. So let's go and change the view first. In the view of login page, we have a condition for patients. And now we need to have another condition for the doctor as well. So for that I'll say L if G is equal to equal to doctor. Here also I'll check for the error that is D is equal to the key will be error and the value will also be error and now I need to send this error to the template that is doctor home so I'll say return space render of request comma doctor home dot html comma d and now we need to check this error in the template for that open the doctor home dot html here I need to write if equal condition that is braces mod space if equal space error is no if there is no error then i need to redirect to the home page of the doctor so for that i'll say window dot location of i need to mention the url of the home that is a braces mod space url space home and now i need to end this uh, if equal condition for that i'll say and if equal and if there is an error, then I'll simply copy this and change this as uh, yes. And I'll give an alert in the script tag that is alert of something gone wrong. And now I need to redirect to the login page. So I'll change this from home to login page. Again, come back to the views.py file. And now I need to update the home page method for the doctor. So I'll simply copy this and change the group name as doctor and also I'll change the template name as doctorhome.html. This gets the doctor's home page and now for the profile page I need to go to the profile method. So here we already have a condition for patient. Similarly I'll copy this and paste it here and now I need to change the group name, model name and the template name. So I'll say G is equal to equal to doctor and here I'll change it as doctor underscore details and the model name as doctor and also we need to change the key and values in the dictionary because we have changed the variable as doctor underscore details so the key will be doctor underscore details and the value will also be doctor underscore details and in the render function I'll change the template name as doctorprofile.html and now the view is updated so now we need to update the template to view the profile page of the doctor so I'll open the doctorprofile.html file here before the form I'll open the loop to iterate the variable so I'll open this as for i in doctor underscore details and close this for loop after the form completes so I'll go down and here I'll say end for and in the input tags I have a value attribute and now we need to view the data in the value attribute so that we will get them on the template so for that to view the name of the doctor in the value attribute I'll say double braces of i dot name and for the email I'll say double braces of i dot email and for the gender i'll say double braces of i dot gender and for the phone number i'll say i dot phone number for address that will be i dot address but this will not be in the tag but in between the tag because this is a text area tag right so and the next one is birth date so i'll say double braces of i dot birth date and for blood group i'll say i dot blood group so save these files 
and we have left with one more thing that is we did not mention the url names in the template so let's quickly go and change the urls and come back so i have changed the template completely and now let's go and check whether they are working good or not and yes they are working fine that's it for now hope you guys like this video make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon for instant notifications from my channel Thanks for watching.